Din Dobri from Poland. Yay, I'm in a new country. It's so exciting. Um, so I'm in Krakow um, and I'm getting a really good vibe from it. I really, really like it so far. Um, people are saying it's the next Prague and I think fuck Prague. <laughs> Krakow is the next I mean, Krakow is just Krakow. Krakow is really, really beautiful. Um, yeah, um, I'm at the old square right now, out right in front of the Church of St. Mary, I think. And that's, let me, whoa, um, there. Hopefully that's coming out, but yeah. And... And the square is really pretty. I'll just show you my views. That building there, I think, is a 16th century marketplace. And downstairs, I hope to go underneath it for an underground kind of thingy. I don't know what it's going to be like. Should be good. Ooh, so. Um, in terms of shopping, just saying, I was really excited to go shopping in Prague and Budapest and then nothing really happened unfortunately, like it just didn't work out, but I am proud to say that already I've bought new earrings and I will show them off. They are Botticelli earrings. <laughs> so I think that's awesome. And um, I'm definitely going to buy more because these were only $3.50 or in Polish currency, 10 zloty. So, yeah, I'm gonna get more earrings. Mm -hmm. Also, I've survived like seven weeks now without wearing jeans and it is getting really cold. So, I think I'm gonna buy jeans here as well, which I'm excited about. It's the small things. Yeah, um, it was really awkward at the hostel when I checked in. The woman charged me double accidentally and she was so embarrassed. She was like, oh no, I'm so sorry and I was like oh no um yeah that's okay just you know just make sure that you can refund me or something and she's like oh yes yes oh I am so embarrassed and I was like yeah that's okay don't worry it's all right just refund the money <laughs> you know she was making a pretty big deal out of it but I, I don't know I was surprisingly chill I don't know why but um yeah so oh my god what is up with all these beautiful European cities and like horse strong carriages. It's so nice. Look at that. Oh. Lovely. Now I'm gonna go for a walk. I'm hoping to find Vavil Castle. It's like some big ass castle. <laughs> and yeah, I think it's gonna look really, really pretty at night. And apparently it's 10 to 15 minutes walk away. I asked a local. And then, and yeah, they were super nice. And what else? Um, so yeah, I'm planning to stay in Krakow for three nights. I've already paid for three nights. Well, I've paid for double, but yeah, no. And then after that, I plan to go to another city called Rotslav, which is not what, how you think it would be spelled. It's actually um, W-R-O-T-C-L-A-W-E, but Rotslav. And that should be super gorgeous. Like no one's ever heard of it. And apparently it's like filled with canals. And it's like the country in Europe with the most canals aside from Venice, Amsterdam and Hamburg. Hamburg I was surprised about too. Since when does Hamburg have canals? Mm. But yeah. So I'm going to go there um, in three days time. Stay there for maybe two days or so. Um, so yeah, I'm super, super excited for that. I really like Poland. I think... I don't know. I mean, I just feel like it's underrated and I'm really happy to be in a place that isn't, uh, you know, super duper touristy. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's super touristy here, but nowhere near as other places, which I really appreciate. And yeah, I don't know what else to say. I think that, that's it. Yep. <laughs> oh shit, how do you say goodbye? I don't know how to say goodbye in Polish, but I'll find out. Goodbye.